Litfuelo. Ritalcitinib. The FDA just approved this new alopecia drug for hair loss. Here's why it's so promising and everything you need to know. Alopecia areata. What is alopecia areata? Alopecia areata is a type of hair loss that occurs when your immune system mistakenly attacks hair follicles, which is where hair growth begins. This can result in hair loss on the scalp, face, and other areas of the body. Who does it affect? This autoimmune disease often develops in young people, typically between their teens and 30s, according to the National Institute of Health. It affects about 2% of the world's population. Treatment options. Until now, we haven't had a drug for adolescents, and there was only one approved treatment option for adults with a severe form of the condition. What is Ritalcitinib? Ritalcitinib, sold under the brand name Litfulo, is a medication from Pfizer, used for the treatment of severe alopecia areata. Pfizer announced on 23 June 2023 that the U.S. Food and Drug Administration FDA has approved ritalcitinib for the treatment of severe alopecia areata in adults and adolescents 12 years and older. Ritalcitinib is the first and only FDA-approved drug for treatment of alopecia areata in both adults and adolescent as young as 12. Clinical Trial Results The FDA approval was based on results of clinical trials in alopecia areata. The Allegro Phase 2b or 3 trial, which enrolled 718 patients with 50% or more scalp hair loss as measured by the severity of alopecia tool, evaluated the efficacy and safety of Litfulo at 118 sites in 18 countries. In this pivotal study, 23% of patients treated with Litfulo 50 mg had 80% or more scalp hair coverage after 6 months compared to 1.6% with placebo. The efficacy and safety of Litfulo were consistent between adolescents and adults. Mechanism of action. Litfulo is an inhibitor of Janus kinase 3, JAK3, and the tyrosine kinase expressed in hepatocellular carcinoma, TEC, family of kinases. Inhibition of JAK3 and TEC kinase family members by Litfulo may block signaling of cytokines and cytolytic activity of T cells which is implicated in the pathogenesis of alopecia areata. Indications and contraindications. Litfulo is indicated for the treatment of severe alopecia areata in adults and adolescents 12 years and older. It is not recommended for use in combination with other JAK inhibitors, biologic immunomodulators, cyclosporin or other potent immunosuppressants. Litfuelo is contraindicated in patients with known hypersensitivity to ritalcitinib or any of its excipients. Dosage and administration. Litfuelo is available in form of capsules, containing 50 mg of ritalcitinib. Recommended dosage is 50 mg orally once daily. Safety and side effects. Safety. Litfuelo is safe and effective when used in accordance with the recommended dosage and administration schedule. Common side effects. Most common adverse reactions reported in clinical trials are headache, diarrhea, acne, rash, urticaria, folliculitis, pyrexia, atopic dermatitis, dizziness, blood creatine phosphokinase increased, herpes zoster, red blood cell count decreased, and stomatitis. Adverse reactions reported with other JAK inhibitors. Infections. Serious bacterial, fungal, viral and opportunistic infections leading to hospitalization or death, including tuberculosis. Mortality. All-cause mortality, including sudden cardiovascular death. Cancer. Malignancies such as lymphomas and lung cancers. MACE. MACE, defined as cardiovascular death, myocardial infarction, and stroke. Blood clots. Pulmonary embolism venous and arterial thrombosis. Other warnings. Serious reactions. Serious reactions including anaphylactic reactions, urticaria and rash have been observed in patients receiving litfulo in clinical trials. Lymphocyte and platelet counts. Treatment with litfulo was associated with decreases in lymphocytes and platelets in clinical trials. Perform.
absolute lymphocyte count, ALC, and platelet counts prior to litfulo initiation. Treatment interruption or discontinuation are recommended based on ALC and platelet count abnormalities. Live vaccines. Avoid use of live vaccines during or shortly prior to litfulo treatment. Drug interactions. Effect of litfulo on other drugs. Litfulo may increase effects and side effects of drugs which are substrate for CYP3A and CYP1A2. Effect of other drugs on litfulo. Concomitant use of strong CYP3A inducer, such as rifampin, may decrease may result in loss of or reduced clinical response of litfulo. Use in special populations. Pregnancy. Available data from clinical trials with litfulo use in pregnant women are insufficient to identify a drug-associated risk of major birth defects, miscarriage or other adverse maternal or fetal outcomes. Lactation. Women should not breastfeed during treatment with litfulo and for approximately 14 hours after the last dose. Hepatic impairment. Litfulo is not recommended in patients with severe hepatic impairment. Thank you for watching. Please like, share and subscribe.